Why is vitamin D so important? You've probably heard lots about vitamin D in the news and media recently, but what exactly is it and why is it so important for our bodies? Well, here are some basics. Vitamin D is a fat-soluble vitamin involved in a huge number of cellular processes in your body. It actually acts more like a hormone than a conventional vitamin. Really, it's difficult to over-exaggerate vitamin D's importance. For example, almost every cell in your body has a receptor for vitamin D, which means that your immune system, muscles, and bones all require vitamin D to function properly. One way of obtaining vitamin D is by exposing your skin to sunlight. However, this natural synthesis can be dramatically reduced if you use sunscreen. Your ability to synthesize vitamin D is also adversely affected by age and strongly influenced by your geographical location. For example, you will be able to synthesize vitamin D all year round if you live in Johannesburg, but only in the summer months if you live in New York, London, or Copenhagen. Not only that, but if you have darker skin, the longer time you'll need to spend in the sun to get your daily dose of vitamin D. But probably the greatest factor in determining the amount of vitamin D we can obtain through sunlight concerns the way most of us in the developed world make a living. We tend to spend lots of hours sitting in an office. The result is we spend fewer hours outdoors exposed to the precious vitamin D generating summer sun. For these reasons, vitamin D is the most common nutritional deficiency worldwide. It's estimated that in the US and Europe, at least 40% of adults are vitamin D deficient, but there are a growing number of scientific teams around the world evaluating the benefits of obtaining an adequate amount of vitamin D. And these teams have established that vitamin D deficiency is implicated in a wide range of health conditions, from fatigue, headaches, and depression, including seasonal affective disorder, to muscle weakness, chronic lower back pain, and bone loss. Research also indicates that if you are overweight, especially if you have excess belly fat, you're likely to have lower levels of circulating vitamin D. On the positive side, though, good amounts of vitamin D in the body have recently been shown to protect against respiratory infections, including colds and flu. And there is exciting new evidence that vitamin D, by influencing specific receptors in several regions of the brain, can improve sleep quality. So where can you get vitamin D from? Well, it takes at least 20 to 30 minutes of full body exposure during the summer to get your daily dose, which admittedly is difficult for most of us to achieve. Alternatively, small amounts of vitamin D can be found in certain foods like salmon, eggs, and fortified cereals. But by far, the easiest way to get vitamin D is from a high-quality supplement.